know my skill, but you don't know how I teach my heart to be as a good fighter. The belt has been waiting for me since the last year. Enough said. Family, the belt is the only thing I've been thinking about for the past three years, and I think I've made the most sacrifice in Lima. So this time around, I'm definitely going to get that belt. Ladies and gentlemen, the blue corner, the challenger, Fendi, the Navy boy, collide! The challenger is in the cage. Let's bring out the champion, the red corner, Damon Su Yan Wei! Ladies and gentlemen, this is for the vacant Malaysian Invasion Bantamweight Championship. Introducing our first fighter, fighting out of the blue corner. He's 25 years old, standing out 172 centimeters tall, weighing in at 60.6 kilos. The fight record of 10 wins and three losses with three TKO victories. His fighting styles, MMA and boxing. He is an amateur MMA Bantamweight Champion, National Boxing Athlete, and the number one ranked Southeast Asian bantamweight from Collide Brothers and Elite MMA representing Saba of Fendi Collide! And his opponent, 
fight out of the right corner. This man is 28 years old, standing at 176 years tall, weighing in at 61.1 kilos. He has a fight record of seven wins and two losses, with three submission victories. His fighting style is MMA and BJJ. He is a FEMA veteran and the number two ranked South Asian, Southeast Asian bantamweight. Fighting out of West Scott Coast Gym from Kuala Lumpur. Give it up for David Sue. And when the action gets underway, our favorite man is in charge of it. Round numero uno, as the old ring girls say. Young ring girls, by the way. Oh. Here we go. They touch gloves. And Damon Sue, we got BJJ versus striker. T typical grappler versus striker. And now remember, again, this is, uh, there's no champion in the point category. Correct, Matt? Our last champion was Prabhu Samanaidu. Ah, the Superman. Prabhu Samanaidu. And now Damon clearly has an advantage if the fight goes to the ground, but... A lot easier said than done to get it there. Yeah, and uh, obviously the Kalai brothers, both of them, I, I love both these guys, but Fendi knows how to throw a punch. He, got, he has an overhand right. That, that is a head lightning off. hook. Miss, but it's lightning fast. And Oliver Cost overlooking the action. David comes with the uh, low kick. Fendi. Just ranging it out, and stucks it, sticks Yeah, it. and that's what we're talking about. Damon should try and level change right away. And not counter punch. Yeah, it, counter punch. Yeah, that, that's probably not a smart idea. I see Mimo one bet, Shama Chandra in the corner. Yep. Shama. We've seen uh, we've seen Damon here before. I would like to see Damon in, in terms of his improvement of the game. He needs to rotate his shoulders around a little bit more. He's got this fantastic ground game like you're talking about, but he doesn't rotate fully with his uh, with his shoulder movement, so that right overhand never really has too much power. And that's Whereas it. the Kalai brother, look at that, just bringing it. Well, Effendi was a pugilist in boxing before he was an MMA fighter. Yes, so. he is. As we he can't, gets tapped on the chin. We can't really compare them in terms of... Damon looking to bring it to the ground, and he does. Let's see if he tries to bring that other knee up and go straight into the mount position as the Kalai brother looks to... Uh, Shake him off and, and get back the, the feet probably. Oh, actually closes guard. Great job. Haven't seen much from the uh, from Effendi off his back. Body, body, head. Stand up, stand up. Body, body, head. Body, body, Again, some good uh, posturing up trying to happen. Well, Effendi, good guard retention and now look. Oh, some rubber guard from Effendi Kalai. Wow. Wow. Very unexpected. He's going for a go-go product. That's that is something I haven't seen the uh, Kalai brothers get into before. Stay in sight. is not what they're known for. Their hands are. That was very interesting. Yeah, great little scramble there. Bringing the knee up, making sure that David can't pass. Right hand. Right hand. Right and a good rubber guard. So that was pretty impressive. Hey, great job. Great job. I enjoyed it. Ten seconds left in this first round. And Effendi did what he needed to do, and Damon has got to start landing from there. Just getting Mount isn't enough. Smiles all around inside the Malaysian Invasion Cage. In the round one, and we'll take a look at that first round in just a moment. Yeah, and the Kalai brother did some, some good uh, counter punching, and uh, Damon had a great takedown. Fin finished the round very strong. Good scrambling happened, and uh, again, like you said, we have not seen the Kalai brothers go for those submissions off their back before. Well, I mean, it was different, and, and that's what you have to do when you're in these kind of fights. You have to improvise, you gotta fight, you gotta look to win, you gotta look find ways to win.
Let's make some noise. Give these guys your spirit and your love. Fantastic fight. And we're going into round two. Lovely ring girls, letting us know. Here we go. Back to ranging each other out in the middle of the cage. And yeah. shots down. And if Finney's got to let his hands go. Oh, nice team. Yeah, Finney's got to get busy. He's got to let those hands go. Oh, nice kicks. Oh, look at Damon. Obviously working with West Child. Yeah, West Child. Yeah, West is actually going to be Sometimes it's like a delay reaction. Like you get hit in the nuts, you don't feel it like three seconds later. Understood. When it hits that part of the brain, it says, hey. So, yeah, so for all those women who say, oh, you think this is that's false. Good shots happening. Combinations and a stiff jab. And yeah. Drop Mr. Kalai. So again, rotate that shoulder. You can see the right shoulder moving, moving through. Nice team. And that was a power. That was like that snap. And look at Damon. Yeah. Answers back. Grinds him up against the cage. Looking for that takedown. Gets the takedown. Damon on top. There were no elbows, though. No. Best amateur. Wow, nice, nice sweep. And Effendi on top. On now, this top. is the thing. Effendi probably doesn't have the best jujitsu, but if he postures up and starts throwing bombs, you're in trouble. Yes. And this is what I'm talking about. Boom. Look, yeah. those are like baseball punches. He knows nothing about rain and everything about hail. Yeah, and that one bothered Damien. He's wicked. But, ooh. Great job. I love seeing it at the amateur level. Nice right hand. Yeah, great combination there. Damon doing a good job of moving forward. Actually, Damon landed a really nice shot. Oh, and, and about to the back. About to have the back. Bringing him over. And looking for that rear naked. And he has it. Stadium Nagara makes some noise for some fantastic bantamweight action. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen in Stadium Nagara, make some noise for offending the line. Again, his knee is a little bit busted up, so we might not have him stand up here. Again, Jason Lowe in the house to present the belt to Tom. Without them, we wouldn't be able to grow the sport we so dearly love. So at 235 of the second round, your winner, via rare naked choke, Damon Suyanwe. Tremendous job by Damon, man. We've seen you all season, or two seasons, three seasons, and now you got that championship belt, brother. What you got to say? I'm speechless. Great speechless. Because you are doing this with me, my country, and I'm doing my fault. I've uh, sacrificed three more years to do this. Now just train, 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 train. I, for one, know that I can speak to the whole way to the family. You're very, very proud.
proud of you, brother. You put in the effort, you put in the time, and we love you, man. And I have to thank everyone that has helped me so far, because there's many people who came to help me in good training and all sorts of stuff, friends, family, you know, they my coaches. Without a doubt, Malaysian Invasion people, fans, make some noise for the new Phantomweight champion. Back with more Malaysian Invasion action in just a moment.